I want to know how you feel about this as well. Like, do you feel satisfied by what you're seeing on YouTube? We live in an age of apology. Don't confuse that with authenticity. Just look around you. Hypocrisy has become both vice and virtue. The, the paedophile priest, the robbing banker, the, the peace-preaching ruler waging a just war, their ten a penny. Every second sucker on every second street has a story to sell. One cannot move for, for outpourings, for confessions, for memoirs, family bloody histories. Like, oh, my ancestry, here's a video of my first shit. Me, 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 me. You're a chef. Just cook. Shut up. You're a gardener. Garden. Shut up. There's no privacy. There's no decorum. They pimp their kids out for the cameras. They, they fashion themselves as holes for the press to fuck. And then they moan and gnash when they get fucked over. The revelations of a bejeweled footballer. Like me, my bling, and other things about me. <laughs> I mean, what next? My crack hell by the Pope. And the podcast, the podcast, an opportunity for every tedious twat in Christendom to broadcast his banalities. Just, just leave us alone. Be quiet for a bit. Some hairy bastard drew a donkey on the side of his cave. He saw it and he drew it. A million years later, hello, welcome to my blog. Today, I bought chia seeds. You cunt! You silly, dozy twat! You've forgotten how to live! Darwin was wrong. Man didn't evolve, he just got better tools. From a, a lump of charcoal to the Apple Mac. <sighs> History. Where's the poetry? Huh? Where's the soul? <sighs> I don't know. Join me next week for a Q&A.